Google Photos is our favorite way to back up photos and videos on the web, but it's not perfect. You can lose access to your Google account or wake up to find some external force has broken into your account and changed your password entirely. This wouldn't be as much of a problem as you might think if Google was simply a standard backup service, but the app is built to make it easy to delete your original copies of photos in order to save space on your phone. And if you lose both copies of your photos, you might be out of luck. The best way to ensure you always have copies of your photos is by manually backing up all of your photos to start with. All that means is you'll want to plug your phone into your computer, then transfer your files from your phone's photos folder over to your computer or external drive. Obviously, this advice is more about safe photo habits moving forward rather than backing up photos you've previously deleted from your phone, but it's a good habit to develop nonetheless. Okay, but what about the photos you haven't already backed up? If your photos are only living in the cloud, it's easy enough to download them individually from Google Photos. Just click the triple lined menu icon in the top right corner of the screen and select download. If you want to download multiple photos to your computer, select each check mark in the top left corner of every photo thumbnail, then select download from the menu icon to download a zip file with your photos. If you have thousands of photos saved in the cloud, you're better off skipping this altogether. Instead, head to myaccount.google.com and select data and personalize from the list of options. Scroll down to the bottom of the page, then select download your data to make a backup of your account data. Now, we suggest deselecting everything on this list, then scrolling down and selecting just photos from the list of available download options. With photos selected, hit next step at the bottom of the page, then select your export options. When you're ready, select Create Export, and Google will begin preparing zip files of all of your photos, divided into two gigabyte zip files, before sending them to your email. This may take a while depending on your photo library size, so be patient as Google prepares your documents. Once you've received your zip files, we recommend keeping them saved on an external drive for safety. If you liked this guide, make sure you subscribe for all sorts of videos covering Google Photos and other technology. And don't forget to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.